me speak with you. Where is your husband? I don't have a husband. Myself? Concerning husband or what? Where is your husband? I don't have a husband. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, I want to pray for you. Where are your children? Where are your children? They are in Limpopo. We need to pray for your children. Amen. Huh? Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Because when you're sitting there, I'm hearing that we need to pray for your children. Amen. Otherwise, the devil can kill them. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. So after we pray for you, I'm seeing that some of your children are doing funny, funny things. Are you hearing me, Mama? Amen. And now, uh, <clears throat> so are they staying there, all of them? Yes. Huh? Yes. Fish, I wanted to ask you something, but I'm afraid to, to, to ask it. I want to pray for, for your children, and God wants to help them. Huh? Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. How many girls are you here? Two girls and one boy. Is there anyone who's pregnant? I don't know. Huh? I don't know if there's one who's pregnant. I don't know yet. No, I'm not saying there's one who's pregnant. I'm asking you a question. Is there anyone who's pregnant? No, as far as I know. No. No one. <laughs> I want to pray for you. Amen. Because I don't want them to do some things behind your back. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. I'm talking about some other things that I can't say it here. And I, I don't want them to do that. Are you hearing me? Amen. But on you, let's pray for your health. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Because I'm feeling that your body is giving you problems. Amen. And these sicknesses that are turning around your body. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. So I'll pray for you and God is going to heal you today. Amen. Huh? Amen. And also you must be careful of arthritis. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. I'm saying what? I must be careful of arthritis. Be careful of arthritis. But your girls, eish. Alright, on track. And this won't be good. Eh? I don't want them to be pregnant and I'll pray for you. God is going to help you. Amen. So but there's no one who must do uh, something. Mama, did you build the house? Yes. Huh? Yes. Huh? Yes. But why I'm seeing that? Huh? Is it finished? Not yet. Huh? Because I'm seeing something like I'm seeing you building a house, and I'm seeing some other parts of the house. It's like it's still. Huh? Is it complete? I'm not seeing that. Uh, it has been roofed, but some parts are not finished. That's what I'm saying. I'm seeing some other parts that are not complete. Yes. Huh? Yes. So God is going to give you money to finish this. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Because you've been struggling with this. Amen. I just saw a house that is... I'm seeing some other parts that are not complete. Amen. And God will give you money to finish this. Amen. In Jesus' name. You're free, Mama. You're free. Amen. Go and finish your house.
Oh, are you married? I'm not married. Let's cancel the spirit of disappointment. Mm -hmm. Come on. I want to pray for you. Are you hearing me? Yes. And I want God to help you today. Okay. Because Is there any lady that you are praying with? In my church. Yes. Yes. Where is she? At home. Huh? Bush Park Ridge, where I'm coming from. Where you're coming from? Yes. So you are praying together? Yes. He's the one who's helping me. Huh? He's the one who's helping me. He's the one who's helping you in the church? Yes. I want you to pray for that lady, huh? Okay. Because there's so many complications about your life. Yes. Are oh, you hearing me? Yes, even myself. <laughs> even myself. So many complications. Ah, she's so wise. Clap hands for her. Clap hands for this mama. The reason why I'm asking, I saw a lady. Yes. And I'm seeing people kneeling down. Huh? Yes. In a room. Huh? Praying, 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 praying. Yes. So uh, let's pray for that lady. Are you hearing me? Yes. Because, to be honest with you, this lady, she's going to help you. Thank you. Uh -huh. Yes, I can see she's interested, but the thing is, she says, got many demons. I try to pray for her, but hey, the yeah, demons is too I'm much. That lady... She suffered many attacks. That's what I'm saying. She's like going to myself, help. I'm attacked. <laughs> but I don't have you. You know, the reason why I'm saying she's going to help you yes. is because some, there are some times, there are days where you just you want to go away from here. Yes. Huh? Yes. Because you've been praying and there's no change. Yes. Huh? Yes. And sometimes you feel like she will attack you. Yes. Huh? <laughs> it's true, man of God. Sometimes you feel like she will deal with you. Yes. Huh? Yes. So, I, I want to pray for you so that God must help that lady. Yes, even my daughter doesn't trust him. Where is Here is my daughter. Which one? This one. She said she's a demonic woman <laughs> inside my church. <laughs> you are laughing. It's a serious issue here. <laughs> that this for is mama. my firstborn. <laughs> You know, uh, we're not, uh, when you're a Christian, let yes. me teach you something. <laughs> you don't fight flesh and blood, are you hearing me? Yes. And, Sissy, <laughs> I, I love your mom. If I, if I can have a mom like this, uh, I'll go far. <laughs> she'll speak everything. <laughs> yes. <laughs> she'll speak everything. I want to pray for you, mama. Yes. And... I saw a woman that you're praying with. Yes. And what I said to you, I said, let's pray for her. Yes. So that God can change her. It's true. And because it's true, you people, you're talking about her. Huh? I don't like her, that's true. Huh? I don't like her. You don't like her? Why? I don't trust her. Why you don't trust her? Like what she's saying now that we feel like sometimes she's the one who's attacking us in the family. So that's what you're feeling? Huh? Yes. Even the congregants has just come out saying that uh, uh, they are everyone, praying by the, Everyone. Everyone. This is a like serious it. matter. Yes. <laughs> ah. One by one. They came they one by one left the church. Out. They leave the church just because they said that too many is a satanist. <laughs> <laughs> you uh, give glory to God. <laughs> it's not best for God. I mean, eh? <laughs> I, wa I wanted to pray for you, but I'm hearing, I, want, I have to ask you about a lady that you're praying with. And you heard what I said, Ceci? Yes, I heard, man of God. Let's, there are some certain things that they need prayer. Because how are you going to be a Christian when you hate someone? Not to say I hate her. But you don't want her. Mm. Yes. 
So I want to ask you a question. Do you want me to pray for your mom for her to go? Or do you want me to pray for your mom for her to stay? You can pray for my mom so that she can stay. As long as she'll be delivered, it's okay. As long as you'll be delivered? Yes, it's okay. No problem. She can stay. Because she is helpful in a way. It's just that, yeah, that's how I was feeling about her. And my instincts don't lie. <laughs> you what? My instincts don't lie. Uh, we don't work about instincts in, in, when it comes to the issues of the it's, spirituality. It's true, men of God. Are you hearing me? Mm. When it comes to the issues of the spirit, mm. instincts don't work. What must work is the spirit of God. It's only if the spirit of God says something, it's only now that you can say, I know she's a bad person. But Even if, herself, she needs deliverance. Yo, Jesus, mama. You are right. <laughs> yes. You are right. Just because there are certain spirits I can see. You are right. <laughs> Many spirits. <laughs> you see, now your mom is reporting you. Huh? This, and, is, a, and this wait, is the reason wait, I brought wait, her wait, here. Wait, mama. mama. Wait, wait. Wait. I'll, I'll, I'm still coming to her. We are talking about this one. Yes. I'm coming to her. So... I want to pray for you. Yes. Let's pray that that lady must be delivered. Eh? It's true, man of God. Are you hearing me? Yes. It was, it's true. This lady, there's, there are so many things that she's thinking about. Mm. Or maybe because you now, they want to make you to be sick. Yes. Are you hearing me? It's true. So I want to pray for you. And I believe God is going to help you today. Thank you. And let's pray and believe God that this lady will be delivered. Yes. Because, I have faith. Huh? I have faith. So what she needs is deliverance. Yes. She even talk mm. with her mouth. Is she not helping you in the house? The, her daughter. Her daughter? Yeah, was in my house. What was she doing in your house? She was cleaning. Is she not cleaning? Yeah. Hmm? Yes. In the house? Yes. But for now, it's no longer cleaning just because after the death of my younger son, there were so many complications in my house just because that boy, the doctor says, uh, is a poisoning and whatsoever. So for now. I'm sure this one is happy now when she's hearing that. I want to pray for you, Sissy. Because even you, your life, you need to put it straight. Mm, that's true. Are you hearing me? Yes, man of God. I want to pray for you. Let's Satan want to use you also to shame your mom. And I believe this is a spirit that doesn't want your mom to go forward with the ministry. Huh? It's true, man of God. Where, 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 where is your person? My person, my boyfriend or husband. I don't know what you call him. <laughs> I don't have a person. You have what? A boyfriend. He's not your person. I'm not sure. That's why I asked if a person is your boyfriend or a husband. But, but why would you talk about a husband? Are you married? No, I'm not. That's why I'm saying, why would you talk about a husband? That's why if you're married, I'll say to you, where's your husband? Oh. I'm saying to you, where is your person? He's staying in Elsbright. Huh? He's staying mm. in Elsbright. What are you people doing together? Hmm? Is he a Christian? No, he's not. Is he not a drunkard? He is. Huh? He is. So, are you not drinking? I do. That's what I'm saying. You remember what I'm saying? I'm coming to her? Yes. So I want God to help you. Huh? Thank you. Man. Are you hearing me? Yes, my Because I'm seeing you living a very rough life. Mama? Yes. This, and the way Satan wants to do it, want you to make you to have this boyfriend, you get another one, you get another one. That is the plan. That's what I want to do in your life. And if 
you keep on like this, you'll be sick. You hear me? Yes, man of God. You'll be sick. So be careful. I want to pray for you so that God must give you marriage. Are you hearing me? Yes, man of God. So your mother, she's crying about you. It's true, man of God. You see, I'm taking time. I'm saying your mother is crying about you. A lot. Huh? Mama? Sometimes she goes away. Yes. Huh? Yes. She goes away and you'll be worrying here in your heart. It's true. So, do you want to kill your mom? No, but I'm not staying with her. No, no, no. Even where you're staying, you come back home late. No. You want me to tell you? Yes, but I only go out sometimes. Like, I'm not a party person. Only sometimes. <laughs> I want to pray for you, for God to help you. Okay. So, one of your problems is friends. Yes, that's true. I agree. Huh? I agree on that one, hundred percent. So now I'm, you are agreeing now. You no, know, this one I agree. No. <laughs> huh? I agree. Your problem is friends. That's true, men of God. And many of your friends, they can end up doing these things of the streets. I'm telling you. They're going to end up doing this issue of sleeping with different people. Your friends. Because they are attacked. And they can end up becoming prostitutes. So I want to pray for you. I'm not condemning you. All of us, we have got a history. So I believe God is going to help you today. Eh? Oh, you hear me? Yes. So I'll pray for you. God will help you. And please, you know when you are a pastor? Yes. Satan will deal with your children. With my children. So I, I want to pray so that God must change their hearts. It's true, men of God. So even you, you'll be fine. Because your heart, yeah. it's a heavy. It's true. Even and high and blood. This can affect your feet. It's true. Are you ready? Yes. So pray for you, you'll be healed today. Must be careful of accident. Eh? Are you hearing me? Yes. No? Yes, my God. Must be careful of accident. So I'm seeing you in hospital. So I'll pray for you as I've prayed for you now. Nothing will happen to you. Demon. You demon. You wanted to hide. You demon. Bring her here. Bring her here. Come out. Come out. You demon. Come out.
Lift her up. I'll pray for you. Huh? Don't worry. We need to pray for you. Huh? And I believe God is going to help you today. Okay. The reason why I call you both, I saw a case. That your cases are almost the same. Okay. Are you hearing me? Yes. And where is your husband? I'm not married. Hmm? I'm not married. There's, there's a certain spirit on you that is also happening on you. It's a spirit of disappointments. Are you hearing me? Yes, man. But always, you people, they, there must be a worry. Leave this lady. Today I'll deal with you. So, you heard what I was saying? No, you hear me? The cases are almost the same. You heard what I said? Yes. Where's your mom? She's at home. And where's your mom? At home, Limpop. Yes. And we need to pray for your mom. Are you hear me? Yes, man of God. You need to pray for the health of your mom. You will have the health of your mom. Okay. Even you. Are you with me? Yes. Huh, Sissy? Yes. Are you with me? Yes, man of God. Because I'm seeing that both of you, Satan want to make you, both your parents to be taken to hospital because of sickness. So I'll pray for you. I want God to help you, huh? Are you hearing me? And I'm hearing business. Are you hearing me? Yes, man of God. Because of what is happening here around you, that you always think, maybe if I do something, no? Huh? Are you hearing me? Yes, man of God. So I want to pray for you so that God must release you from this stagnation of finances. Same as this one. Huh? It's hmm? true. Hmm? It's true. When was your last time you went to the doctor? Huh? February this year. February. Huh? You went to the doctor when? Sorry? You went to the doctor when? February this you year. You were doing what? For checkup. For checkup. Yes. Huh? The doctor said what? You are sick. No. Bring, bring her. The reason why I'm saying this is because. Your, your insight. Huh? We need to pray for your stomach. That's true. Are you hearing me? Yes. So I'm hearing some complications in your stomach. That's true. Huh? That sometimes there's a funny pain. It's true. Are you hearing me? Yes. And this can try to form something like a small fibroid. Hmm? Are you hearing yes. me? Yes. I'm saying what? I'm hearing your pain. It's true. And this can cause, this can cause. Five robots. So I'll pray for you and God is going to heal you. Thank you. Are you hearing me? Yes, my Lord. It was on you. Sometimes you are not feeling well. It's true. Are you hearing me? Yes. Because I'm seeing you thinking too much. It's true. About your health. Huh? That's why I said to you, did you go to the doctor? Because I saw you consent and you went to consult. So, but I'll pray for you and God is going to heal you. Huh? Thank you. Are you hearing me? Yes. You want to marry? Yes. 
When? Whenever. <laughs> Is it all? Huh? Is it all? Are you staying together? No. Huh? No. Hmm? No, we're not staying together. Because Satan also wants to make you to have children from different fathers. Are you hearing me? Yes. I'm saying what? To have children with different fathers. And after I pray for you, this man must do something. I'll, by praying for him, I'm doing him like this, saying, go and marry. Jesus. No. Hmm? No, I don't have children. You want a child? No. Why not? Oh, yes, I do. <laughs> you want a child? Yes. Uh, my sister. <laughs> you know, I'm praying for you. I want to leave you, but I'm hearing issue of, issue of a child. Huh? I don't have children. That's why I'm saying, I want to pray for you and leave you. Because even today you are questioning why. Are you hearing me? Yes. Huh? Yes. Hmm? Yes, man of God. So, but marriage must come first. Mm. It's true. for me to be power station. Even you must be careful of sickness. Are you me? Yes, man of God. No. 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 Well, I'm feeling something here. When? 
next day by February. It happened already. Um, you heard what I said? Yeah? So why am I asking about the baby? Uh, hey. <laughs> you want to reveal secrets? No, don't worry. You are free. Thank you. Uh, Mama, you people, you are free. And don't worry, Ceci, you, you are healed. Are eh? oh, you hearing me? I think I took time. You're free. Come here. Molo, uh, they do what they want to get. That's what I want. and savior, like Baba. Where? Huh? I was teaching it before I relocated to Wells Bridge. Then I knelt before I was going to go to Post Firehouse. So, like, there actually, I even stopped drinking. So the reason that I went back, it's because of, like, my situation. It was not changing, so I felt like... I'm not doing <laughs> So, you... You went back, but you went to drink again. Yes. Huh? Yes. That's what I'm saying. You went back, but you are drinking again. So we'll pray for you for that prayer. Because the minute you are a Christian, you go back and drink alcohol. Everything has been cancelled. Okay. But what last I'm week, to I decided and I prayed about it that I want to go back again. But you need pray. somebody to pray for you. Yes. Thank you, man of God. Oh, you don't want prayer? No, I need it. Okay, you are free. Thank you. You people, you are blessed. Thank you so much. Ma'am, can you please tell us your name? Tell us where you come from and also introduce the lady next to you. My name is Pastor Meiva Morane from Bushback Ridge. Yes. The lady next to you is my daughter. Confirm the prophecy that you received today. A man of God from inside. Apostle prophesy us that uh, I'm having a ministry problem. Yes, I confirm that my ministry is having a problem. And uh, he even prophesied my daughter concerning marriage. 
So until the deliverance here, yes, but I'm satisfied with the prophecy and the deliverance also. How are you feeling? I'm feeling very much excited just because I know what will be delivered at the end of the day. Everything will be okay. Yes. Ma'am, today they gave you a prophecy. Confirm it whether it's true or not and refer it back to your life if it's true. Okay, I would like to confirm the, the prophecy uh, regarding the or oh, the job. The first the first one that men of God prophesied about it was regarding my job that I'm satisfied with. And then also about the the marriage issue. Also I can confirm that it it is true. Um, I can say after, because this month is my last month at work, so I was a bit stressed actually, yes. No, I'm okay. Yes, I believe that from today something better will come up. Uh, never lose hope, keep their, they must keep their faith in God.